Hi everyone, in this video we're going to introduce a way of showing multiplication using a shorthand notation and that is the concept of what's called an exponent. So if you have 3 and you're doing 3 times 3, what you can do is you can write this as 3 to the second power. Okay, 3 here is called the base factor. So these are the base. The base is 3. And the number 2 is called the exponent. Okay, so this number here is your exponent. And basically, there's two 3's, so you put a 2. So if it was 3 times 3 times 3 times 3, well, there's four 3's, so you put a 4. If you have 9 times 9, that would just be 9 squared. That's how you read it. Uh, here would be here it would be three to the fourth power. If you have say two times two times two, this there's three twos, so you would say it's two cubed or two to the third power, etc. Um, so let's do let's do some examples of actually computing some things. So let's say we have um, six squared. So six squared means six times six because it's a two, so you have two sixes. And we know from multiplication that that's equal to 36. So we can say that 6 squared is actually equal to 36. Let's try uh, another example. Say we have uh, 9 squared. So 9 squared means it's uh, 9 times 9. And again, just from multiplication, 9 times 9 is equal to 81. So we can say that 9 squared is equal to 81. Sometimes you can have numbers that have more than one digit. So you can have a base that has two digits, and that makes it harder. So for example, say we have, um, say we have 30 squared. So 30 squared means you know 30 times 30. And you can work this out the long way, and you'll basically get 900. So 900 is the answer here. If you work it out, you do get uh, 900. So 900. Uh, another example could be something like, um, how about 6 cubed? So 6 cubed is 6 times 6 times 6. So we know um, that 6 times 6 is 36. So we can take the 6 and the 6 and rewrite it as 36 times 6. So now we just have to work this piece out. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and, and go through the actual multiplication. So what you would do is you'd put the 36 here and then the 6 down here. Then you draw a line and you put the time symbol. And then 6 times 6 is 36. So you put the 6 here and you carry the 3. 6 times 3 is 18. 18 plus 3 is 21. So you get 216. So this is equal to 216. So 6 cubed is equal to 216. So that's it. I just wanted to briefly introduce the notion of exponents as a shorter way of writing multiplication whenever you're multiplying the same number by the same number. I hope this video has been helpful.